Why can't this guy launch the girl sky high on the trampoline? Well, according to Newton's third law, every action has an equal and opposite reaction. This means the force you apply to the top of the trampoline is exactly what gets transferred to the person lying at the bottom, minus a bit of loss in the process. It's similar to a seesaw. If you push down on one end, the other end sends someone flying up. The main difference? A seesaw might break more easily, but it's got a smoother surface which is great for acrobatic acts. The performers find it easier to land and balance on it. Using a seesaw for flying acts, however, might be a tad too challenging for the average Joe. Despite the risks, thrill-seekers from around the globe haven't stopped taking on inflatable trampoline challenges. Take little Mario lying at the edge. Could he be launched even higher? With warm-ups done, you can see it. The moment the two guys hit the trampoline, Mario shoots up, easily reaching about 30 feet. And to push the limits further, they even hoisted a heavy load with a crane to see how high different objects can fly.